You take us all to dinner to celebrate, right, Dave? Yeah, if we all get right. this thing done. Don't do that. No, you can, well, don't, but, but be a good. Crazy. Change your face. Good faith. Barstool Pick'em. We are back. We're brought to you by our friends at Game Time. You shouldn't have to worry when you're buying tickets to the next big event. Game Time is the fast and easy way to buy tickets for all sports, music, comedy, and theater events near you. I've used it for everything. Baseball. I went to a college football game. I went and saw Nate Bargatze at the Chicago Theater. Uh, I'm going to probably go to some NBA games this year. Everything. College bowl games. Go to Game Time right now because they have last-minute deals, flash deals, zone deals. You can get it all if you're trying to go to the Rose Bowl. If you're trying to go... I'm going uh, to the Rose Bowl. You're going to the Rose Bowl? Very excited. If you're trying to go to the Rose Bowl, it's going to be an incredible, incredible atmosphere. Uh, use Game Time. So it's easy to find and buy tickets for every kind of event in your area. They're obsessed with finding ways to help you save money on tickets. Game Time has deals on tickets right up to the start of the event. And even an hour after it starts, it's the place to find last-minute seats. Find exclusive flash deals and sponsored deals on tickets for football, basketball, baseball, concerts, comedy, theater, and more. So go right now. Take the guesswork out of buying tickets with Game Time. Download the Game Time app. Create an account. Use code PICKEM for $20 off your first purchase. Terms apply. Again, create an account. Redeem code PICKEM. For twenty dollars off, download Game Time last minute tickets, lowest price guaranteed. If you love this show, then go use code Pick'em. It helps us. Uh, okay, Pick'em season finale, bowl season. How we doing, boys? Everyone's here in person. We're here for uh, the finale of Barstool or Surviving Barstool. Um, I don't know if we have the camera. There's an there's an extra person in this room. It's Dave, Rico, Hank, and then we have someone sitting in a chair here. I don't know if you can show him. Can we show him? You're showing him? Okay. Liam's holding the camera. Oh, Liam's got the camera. Yeah. Um, Benjamin Mintz in a dunce hat. Yeah. By the time this airs, he, he spoiled the the second to last. What do they call that? The penultimate. Penultimate. penultimate um, surviving Barstool. He just went on Wake Up with Mincy and just said who the final three were. Twice. Twice. Just – I. I haven't been that. It was one of those moments, like it. I really caught wind of what happened maybe a minute and a half before I was walking into the office. So I was furious. We, I mean, we've talked about it before. The when I have to text you and be like, "We got a problem," it's the worst because I mean, you I just don't know what's going to happen I mean, after that. A lot of people in the bullpen going towards the out, like the the Mincy railing, scurried yeah. over and out. we backed the fuck yeah. away. Mincy like, had. Had just once he once he fucked up, he grabbed his backpack and just ran away. Literally, literally, literally ran, ran. So he wasn't here. I can't believe he was on air without a dump button. Like I, I thought that was crystal clear that he is too stupid to do live programming ever again without a one minute delay. Somebody watching and all, oh, Mincy said the n word. Oh, Mincy spoiled surviving Barstool. Oh, Mincy did this. You dump it. You don't let it happen. He's proven he can't talk. So I was beside myself that he spoiled it. So I was running around looking for Mincy. He was gone. Um, I ended up getting uh, the the text Stefan. Stefan and just. Yeah, I heard it. I was upstairs I and you were downstairs and I heard it. It was ripped him apart. I actually apologized on the way because I, I couldn't tell the dump button what I, what we figured out. First, he's like, yeah, we have a dump button, but no one was paying attention to what he was saying because it was too busy setting up for Surviving Barstool. It's like, well, how dumb are you to let this guy... He's done 12 Wake Up With Mincy's. He's had two international incidents in 12. So, like, the guy... 17%, he said. Yeah, he can't... He can't go on... Like, you can't let him go. You can't. So, it's like, well, what's the point of a dump button if you're not going to pay attention? Turns out we didn't even have a dump button for his Which setup. I, I take Which a little blame. I thought on, we had one, That's too. on you. That's on you, Yeah, Wayne. no, I thought we had one. I absolutely like, I, thought I, we had one. I, it was crystal clear. Wake up with Mincy never comes back until we have a yeah. dump button because he is incapable of of going freelance. He is he can't make it more than two episodes without something major. So, I was killing Stefan. It's not set up. Wake up with Mincy is once again canceled mm -hmm. until or postponed, and it, it's indefinitely. And Mincy until there's did, a dump button. He did point out that it's a shame because they had a lot of momentum. 
They had a lot. Yeah, twelve. He had a lot of momentum. And then I'm like, didn't you do radio on ESPN? He's like, I never had an issue. Yeah, they I, they have a dump button. Yeah, like, no, I was saying like, there's a He's chance. Talking that, to air. Yeah, Mincy did three hours of radio every day, and just all of it was dumped. And he so, just walked out and was like, I crushed that. And the producers are like, whew, dodged another one. So he's just, um, today, he's, I mean, I I haven't yelled at Mincy even when he did his last one. I mean, I, I, I was doubly mad he wasn't here. I screamed at, I, I haven't been that mad in a long time. I and mean, I think in this office, it's like the Happy Dan Club. Like, you're a more cheery guy. People haven't, like, no. people were. That's true. I, I, it brings me back. It's funny. Ducking. The energy. energy. Oh, people were cover. diving around. <laughs> like, <laughs> we, like, everyone is kind of going towards the railing. Like, ooh, let me look at, like, here's the shark. He's about to eat something. Everybody's like, <laughs> uh-oh. He's fucking, like. Megan, no, it was like a, it was like an old Western uh, movie where, like, the, the b- big bad bow comes back into town and people are just diving into saloons. Omar and, like, coming. Getting, Omar yeah, coming. Getting underneath their beds and being like, oh, no we got to get out of here he's back megan making money has the least situational game awareness of any human <laughs> I, I didn't know this ever this. Yeah. fucking met i came in and she's in the lobby she's got some fucking sandwich that looks like gruel she's like hey you want a sandwich i was like no i was storming around in circles trying to find mincy trying to find tech people couldn't find there i think there was literal steam coming out of my ears I screamed at like two people. I come back around. She's like, "You sure you don't want this sandwich?" It's <laughs> like, "Shut up!" Like, wake up and see. Like, read the room. Meg, making, oh. me, Megan making money. Her but defense like, was very good. It was very good. Uh, like I, I will say, and we said about Mincy, it's like, it's hard. It's like a dukes. It's like, what are you? He's so lovable. It, like, what are you gonna do when someone's like, "I'm just so stupid." It's like there's nothing more to yell. It's just, it really sucks to. Hopefully it didn't get as widespread. How many people? Our problem with our crowd is, is they people are jerks. They revel in gonna, spoiling. Yeah, it. they're going to intentionally go out of their way. So you know we've made it this whole season. It's almost like a storyline because I, even when I was in New York with KFC with uh, Barcelona Radio, I was like, "Do not talk about. It. You're going to spoil it. It's impossible not to spoil." So I've been. Very scared of that. We've yeah, we haven't little, talked about it at all yeah. on the yak. All because not it's to, so hard. Well, because you say something and then you accidentally say like, "Oh, this person's been around all week." Yeah, right. And so those are those suck. Those are spoilers. People can figure some, to do some things. Mincy, God love him. He like that was the most efficient spoiling I've ever seen in my life. He just went straight to it. He's like, "Hey, here's what I'm spoiling." I, I think, and it's I think here. these three know. I know these three are in the final. Stack. <laughs> yeah, like, it wasn't know. actually. Actually, no, I do know. Yeah, it yeah. wasn't like because uh, you know, there's been a couple times where people are like, "Oh yeah, Stephen Che was getting followed around all week or something like that," and people are like, "Oh well, clearly he's around all week." Mincy was just like. I don't know if you want this spoiler, but I'm giving it to you. I'm shoving it down your face, like just like With no answer. Stuffing. Like, did you watch the episode last night? He's like, no, I didn't know where they were at. We gotta make like, a me- like you don't you don't even know. He's just so dumb. We gotta make the meme where it's uh, Kevin from the office and it's it's Michael Scott. Michael Scott is Mincy, and the broccoli is a spoiler. And he's just shoving it in our fucking audience's <laughs> face. <laughs> he's like, you're gonna eat this. There's nothing you can do about it. Uh, and then. I, like literally, people. It's I, this was written in pure anger. Oh yeah, I, have it pulled up. My, my, I thought the whole thing was going to be all caps. You only did the cap. The, the this, yeah, all like caps. I this, thought the body was going to be. Caps. This is, was at nine forty four a.m. in the heat of me still being <laughs> as mad as I could be. All caps. Subject line: Ben Mintz is too dumb to ever be live without a minute to lay dump button. I can't believe I have to write this since it's already crystal clear but ben mintz cannot be on any program live ever without people paying attention having a minute delayed dump button if he doesn't have it then he can't be on any live programming because he is too dumb this is not a joke and i told mincy from now on anything he's on he has to sit before he opens his mouth is there a dump button if someone says no he gets his fat ass up and walks off he can't be on anything that doesn't have a dump button he's incapable He's so he's so stupid. He's, so it's, he's I, I I likened he's, it to like everyone's knows like there's one kid in the family who just fucks up, but like you know like it's mom's favorite, and like there's nothing they can do. Like the other kid's a doctor, the other kid's a lawyer, and then this one kid he's just you know doing a wake up show and just having problems all the time. It's like, but he I love him. He when you weren't there up in the office, he's like it's been six months since the last screw up. Yeah, but uh, two days since you brought back <laughs> wake up Mitzi, you haven't done content. He's got to start act three. 
I said it to him. Act, act one was 40 years. Act two was six months. Now it's time for act three. It's crazy. It, it, and he is a little, got a little rain man in him. Because yeah. it, it, like, when you were doing the math, he corrected you on the perfect <laughs> math of, like, the 17%. I said, it was, of, I said no, he goes. It's 16 points. Yeah, 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 no, like, he goes. I did. I thought it'd be higher. No, yeah, I literally right said, I was like, because I was just doing it in my head. I was like. Oh yeah, two out of twelve. Like that's like ten percent. He just is like, actually, it's seventeen percent. <laughs> it's just poker. Yeah. It's Dustin Wapner. Wapner like, doesn't yeah. know right from wrong. Yeah. Poker, but man. Poker he man. has that math. He's, he's got a goldfish swimming around in his head, but yeah, he poker. does have that math thing. Poker. It is like the office too, and he just went like a runaway runaway train. Yeah, he like sprinted. He just, he just went to the railroad. It was like I'm getting out of here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. when I called him, I'm like, "Where'd you?" He was like, he said, "It's we have it." I think on it was being recorded. It's like I ran away. <laughs> I, like and worming. he just ran apparently full speed because it took him forever to get Forrest back. Gump, <laughs> like worming around us. We gotta get the fuck out of yeah. Dodge in the parking lot. Like, let's go. Oh man! So that was a twist to start the morning. Wasn't expecting that. No. I, it, and those are. There's been a couple times in Barstool where things hit right at the time to get me like as mad as I can be because I haven't had time to digest it. So it's like I literally we were pulling into the parking lot when I found out, and I was just enraged. <sighs> Mincy, 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 Mincy. All right, so yeah, twice, 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 yeah. and it was so. Again, it was the most efficient spoiler ever. It wasn't like, oh, I'm gonna spoil it or like turn off if you haven't watched. He's like, hey, here's the here's the final three. <laughs> Maybe it's the final three. No, this is the final. Yeah, three. yeah, it, yeah, yeah. He, 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 almost, he almost opened it up for like a non-spoiler, but he's yeah. like, no, actually confirmed yeah. final three. And, and by the way, did you watch last episode so you know where they're at? No, he did not. So <laughs> I don't know, like, in what world he thought he, he that's that's him. He's just there's nothing going on up there. Uh, all right, so uh, yeah, that's the start of it. Um, we're all here. It's the finale of Pick'em. How's everyone feeling? How's everyone doing gambling wise? We have um not great. Dave, you are you're closing in on your second Pat Hill trophy. Yep. I love which it. would be uh so you and I would be both two time winners. Is it like even Well, it's bowl season. I, I, I would have hot. to get I'd have to go in I don't you, think I can catch you actually. I think so, you I need you to get really cold and I gotta get hot. Yeah. Dave's at fifty four percent, one hundred and seven and ninety one. Yeah, big that yeah, it is gained yeah. that much. Yeah. I'd almost well, have to I started lose horrifically, game. so yeah. Well, I'm gonna play every bowl game. So if I win every bowl game, I guess I'd have a chance. I don't even know that you would. It would ha- I'd have to be like side in total every bowl game. And then like I'd sixty probably, and up. I'd still probably have to go. <laughs> yeah. Um Rico seventy three and seventy one, fifty point seven, and I am exactly on the dot, which is Ooh. Pretty insane. Two eighty five and two eighty five. Diaco is wide open. Diaco is wide open. Yeah. Diaco is I, wide I open. I wish I didn't start so bad. I'd be in it. Diaco has uh Ebo at eight and six. Uh Jack McCarthy at eight and six. Zupi at seven and six. David at eight and seven. That's gonna be should we do one mortal lock for bowls and then one mortal lock for the semifinal? I think that's the way you've done it in the past. Yeah. Or, or two mortal locks. Yeah. Or yeah. And we may have to do a bonus, right? Because what if there's, there's a lot of. Yeah. We might have to do the national a championship. Championship. championship game. Yeah. Championship game. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Um, All right. If you've been watching, Surviving Barstool Factor has been uh, feeding us the whole way. It's some of the best stuff we have. Uh, unbelievable meals. This bustling holiday season, you might be looking for nutritious, flavorful meals to fuel you on jam-packed days. Factor, America's number one ready-to-eat meal delivery service, can help you eat well for breakfast, lunch, and dinner with chef-prepared, dietitian approved ready-to-eat meals delivered straight to your door. You'll save time and stay on track with your healthy lifestyle while tackling all your holiday to-dos. Cross meal prepping off your list this holiday season with Factor. Skip the meal planning, grocery shopping, chopping, prepping, and cleaning up and get Factor's fresh, never-frozen meals delivered to your door. Treat yourself to high-quality, Delicious meals over the holidays. Factor isn't just for dinner. Count on extra convenience any time of the day with an assortment of 55-plus add-ons to suit various preferences and, and tastes. Choose from quick breakfast items, lunch to go, grab and go. Um, choose from quick breakfast items, lunch to go, grab and go snacks, and ready to drink cold pressed juices, shakes, and smoothies. This December, get Factor and enjoy eating well without the hassle. Simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh, flavor-packed meals delivered to your door. Head to factormeals.com slash Rico50 and use code Rico50 to get 50% off. That's code Rico50 at factormeals.com slash Rico50 to get 50% off. How's everyone doing? Rico? 
How Good. you feeling? Good. I think uh, apology is in order. Um, me being the guy to do it, like when you get a little out of hand, like and and you start to roll, like I I'm not the guy who should then be pounding a guy like that and taking a joke too far. Uh, and that's what I did to Jack. And you know, I know he doesn't really want to hear it or have time with it but wait uh, what is it? Here, here's a little context i was walking around after i came downstairs like 45 minutes before we recorded and, and rico was just chasing jack being like give me 30 seconds give me 30 seconds jack was like, i'm not talking to you i'm not talking to you i'm not talking to you." yeah friendship means a lot i have said he's one of the hardest working guys and one of the guys i love here the well, most well minus obviously. the south africa football fair uh okay, sure. so yeah it got it got a little out of control. It's what? It's, what are you, I don't, I'm lost. I'm I'm very lost. I thought you were going to say something about Che. You're talking but about the song you sang on that. What are we talking about? Yeah, that just it, just piling on, you, and piling say, on, Jay? and piling on. It's an unfair thing to say. Wait, you're not on. Zuby's got to turn you on. It has nothing to do with South Africa. It's mostly the entire internet thinking I'm a massive cocaine right. and that's, addict and because of Rico. I thought you were going to say sorry that Zoopy what, and, and what, Malisax cares? wrote the song. I also yeah. agree with that. Wait, and well, but, well, but we just so back. just we to clarify, clarify. We were spit I don't know. We got to get the other mics on. Just to clarify, Jack is not a massive cocaine. No, yeah, he not. does do coke. <laughs> what, See, what? That, that's how things get out of control. <laughs> I want to apologize for that now. I think it's yeah, KB it's, got kicked out of a hotel for stashing coke. <laughs> Fair. In Vegas. People have said I'm a cokehead. That's been like right. one of the number but one things I, on me, coke. Yeah, and I, and I, I, I'm not a coke. I'm very much, I mean, I'm old now and I have kids, so I'm, my partying days are over, but I loved the smell of cocaine back in the day. I'm also on the record saying if you've never been at a part of coke, you're a loser. That's true. Right. Facts. Yeah. What's that? That's a, that's a fact. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Jack's been a Rico's lot of them. a loser. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. You've never been at a party with Coke? No, that's not true. Uh, oh. Well, first of all, well, you and you and Jack don't hang out office. socially. We can't hear dick. I don't know why office. they can't. I, well, Zoopy's not usually the one who's sitting there. Oh. It's usually memes sitting there. Yeah, I mean, I'm turning them on, and it's just not working. I don't know yeah. what's going on. But what the hell? Yeah, hey, see, go, get, go get memes. Go grab memes. He can do it. It's snowballed. It's, it's snowballed. Or Hank can do it. What, like stranger? So, wait, that's a joke, though. So I think wait, got, but wait. Uh, no, it's not a joke. You what snowballed. I call, yeah, I call in my phone. KB is listed as KB, like, Coke swag. <laughs> <laughs> Those two aren't. Yeah, I don't know. It's just he the whole internet's booted. coming for that, him. It's, that's the most I felt, yeah. forgotten story. He literally got kicked out of his hotel in yes, Vegas. That, yeah. Wait, so you're apologizing and you're done with That's what you're it. apologizing for? Uh, <laughs> All the thing. That's the first formal apology. Yeah, that was like a very had serious in apology. Like three or four yeah, presidencies. It. And it's for that joke? You've done far more hideous things than that. All your other apologies. All your other apologies were like forced out of you, where it's yeah. like, oh, something really bad came to light, and now I have to apologize. You just willingly apologized for a coke joke and took like a deep breath before. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. People can change. That was a Tom Brenneman. Yeah, I want to get in front of it. Yeah, it's our friendship means a lot. He's very upset at me. I'm not very it's upset. Christmas. Relax. So wait, so uh, just so no, actually, what? Holiday. Hanukkah and it's Hanukkah. Yes, you're it's right. I did say, it's literally, literally Hanukkah. Christmas it's coming up. Literally, right. yes. We're I did fight a lot Hanukkah. of battles right now, Rico. I agree. It's I literally, totally literally agree. Hanukkah. Yes, literally. Yes, Joey Yanks. So it's wanted, not. It's not. It's Joey not Yanks Christmas. suggested and down the road. And then it's he, Hanukkah now. It is Hanukkah. And Joey Yanks suggested a Yale blue colorway for that Harvard clown shirt. But I heard Yale is a little like Fugazi too. All those Ivy League schools yeah. there. So wait. So no more Coke jokes. Uh, not from me. No, the coach jokes can stay. I would prefer if Rico doesn't tweet photos of me where I may be under the influence of Coke. Not well, Coke. But <laughs> in fairness, that was a Black Friday promo yeah, of a highlight video. That doesn't matter, bro. Yeah, that's fair. No, it's not. It said support our producers. These guys work hard. Our biggest party animal, and it was a highlight reel of Jack. No, it was a straight photo of me. All right, so so you're gonna slow down on the Coke jokes, but Jack, you're gonna keep doing Coke. No, I have no problem with uh, our okay. employees doing coke as long Fair. as they don't do it during uh, business hours, right. <laughs> and that they probably still are around here. Who fucking knows? Right. Mincy sober, California sober. We My, yeah, minus. <laughs> <laughs> we good, Jack? Mincy, sure, bro. Mincy sober. What I went that? to a, I went to a, a, sure, a bro's like no. dead concert with him a couple years ago, and someone in our suite uh, offered up mushrooms, and Mincy like tripped over everyone trying to grab them, but he's sober. <laughs> 
He only does shrooms and weed. Sober. We could, uh-huh. Jack? I mean, not really. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man, we got to rebuild. We got to live in that world. Okay. Is this still soft? For the no, they're, they're, you can hear him now. All right. Speak again. Hello, hello. Yeah, check, yeah. check, check, check. W- so, um, I reached out to Smacky Jables. He will be turning the content down as no, well. No, I like him. I mean, some, okay. it's kind of like I also the, think the it's bullshit. You steal yeah, shit. it happens. Yeah, you can't put what? The it happens. Tube, what are you going to do? Think. All right. Also, give credit about that song because well, you didn't we write were, shit we were, about that. I mean, oh, you I didn't wish, write that song? No. I wish we had the footage. That, and he doesn't before, credit oh, people. That's where you should apologize for. Apologize to Zoopy and Malasek and Ebo. We're, no, we're, you we're should apologize bowling. for that. We're spitballing before. I say a couple lines. They say a couple lines. How many I go, lines we'll all do it together. Give? And then no one else sang with me. How many lines did you give Ebo? How many lines did Rico give? Uh, I actually I didn't write. He wasn't there. I was there. It was Malasek. Zoopy Zoopy can answer. How many lines did he give Zoopy? Uh, I. How many lines did Rico give? Yeah, did he create? Like when we're doing song credits and we're gonna, because obviously we're gonna put this on Spotify and it's gonna be like at some point we're gonna have to. There's gonna be royalty that we got to pay out. Who gets the credit? So Rico came into the Zoom singing Africa. He was singing the song, and then me and Malasek just started riffing a little bit on the lines. Malasek gave the, uh, my credit card has cocaine residue line. Yeah. And then I gave the, honey, what's it going to take to make that check mark blue line? Okay, so, so, so Rico had zero Two lines. Bangers. Zero lines. That's what you should apologize well, for. Well, you get a heat. That. Jack from like your family or something. What do you care? I mean, I, I don't love that my mom now thinks I'm a cokehead, but oh. yes, yeah, it's, it's it's show business. <laughs> I honestly don't really mind too much. It's just the outside world. But I also I'm more mad about Rico taking a funny song from somebody else and playing it off on his own. Yeah, you got to give credit. Right, that was someone else's song. Yeah, I feel like Hesh, because that was a banger. Yeah, it was. Apologize to both. But also, I didn't demand an apology. I want that on record. That's crazy. I, I, I willingly did it. That was a weird apology. Crazy. Okay, that's how much it means. This is, this is where your heartfelt <laughs> apology came in. An, un, an unforced heartfelt apology, which you've never given. I'm a fucked up guy. But yeah. I'm like you've done. You have done. I was a fucked up you guy. You have committed war crimes. Yes. I was a fucked up And guy. never apologized. I was a fucked up guy. It's like, it'd be like Hitler apologizing for jaywalking. Yeah. Like, <laughs> but sincerely. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm God. so sorry. Want to let everyone know? Yeah. I didn't have the, I didn't have the little white <laughs> walk light. <laughs> like, Should when you start it? there, I have to really, like, getting choked up with the deep, like, the, the Jack Mac Coke <laughs> jokes. Like, well, Jesus. I had no idea where that was going. <laughs> Because if you let that go, then who knows what's next? I'm trying to stay on that okay. path of righteousness. What? Uh, so what's going on in the college basketball world, Rico? What, what's the content we got coming up? I, you're going to Creighton, Alabama? I'm going. It's my Christmas present. I'm going to Bama Creighton and then driving three hours to uh, Manhattan, Kansas. I'm oh, nice. What What time is the Bama Creighton game? 7.30. Shout out John Rothstein. He had that. Yeah, he did. He did. He had the time, remember? That's the game. Yeah. 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 There was a controversy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he didn't have the What's day. with the Dahmer glasses? I don't know I if I like, like them. I like the look a lot. I don't Very know. It makes me a little artistic. scared. I like them. <laughs> he, looks, he looks artsy. Yeah, I like it. It is Dahmer. Uh, so, yeah, to give us a little college basketball, what's coming up? We got Bosco and one back? Yeah, we're going to try and get uh, try and get Fanta before the holidays, and then we got to try Love and hit that. the pavement with, uh, with the guests here and there. So, But I think just doing it on YouTube with its own – thing might not work i might just double it up with healthy debate I, what do you mean so like why get why spread out your takes i agree with on that. your own youtube like get the guests on healthy debate There's, you know i know a lot of college basketball people in the industry uh talk to them coaches whatever like you know they might not want to be live but whatever you tape it you figure it out and then uh we go that way we the have dumb buttons now 40 minutes of 40 minutes of hell you know tuesdays or tuesdays and thursdays or tuesdays and thursdays college basketball related calls heavily so Okay. You know, focus in all the opinions in. in Wait, 40 Minutes of Hell is on Healthy Debate. Yes. I like that. That's like the segment part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Because most of the calls, like, right from the get-go are college basketball guys anyway. Right. People right. want to talk college basketball with me. I like that. And Dave was right. You know, you don't need 52 different things in a podcast. Like, make it work. This seems like it's working. People like calling. You can interact live instead of just a voicemail. So, you know, listen to the coach. Yeah. Run the play. I like that. Um, Hammer set to the corner. What? All right, let's take a quick break from Pick'em to tell you about our friends at Vroom. 
We all know how much of a hassle buying a car can be. You spend so much time driving around trying to find the perfect car, negotiating over the price, and worrying about the quality of the vehicle. But not anymore thanks to Vroom. Vroom is uh, the better way to buy and sell used cars. When you go to Vroom.com, you can shop thousands of cars right from your phone. They have all the popular makes and models and no haggle pricing. So you know what you're getting. You know you're getting a good deal. Best of all, they'll deliver a new ride directly to you. Vroom stands by its vehicles to every car and truck from Vroom goes through a thorough inspection and reconditioning process and comes with a 90-day limited warranty. On top of that, you have seven days and 250 miles, whichever comes first, to make sure it's the car for you. And if you don't love it, you can return it. You can also sell or trade in your current car on Vroom and they'll pick it up for free. Just answer a few questions about your car on the Vroom website and you'll get an offer in as little as two minutes. You have no obligation to sell, so there's nothing to lose. So whether it's buying your car, selling, or trading in your current one, Vroom has you covered. Start shopping at Vr- today at Vroom.com. That's Vroom.com. Have you guys had your meeting about contracts? Uh, no. I don't want to make you do it here. I'm just asking. No. I think he's got a lot going on if he declines dinner. Uh, when, are we, can- when, when, is, when are you thinking dinner? Five? Today. Yeah. Okay. Back out 7.15 tomorrow. Healthy debate goes 3 to 4 local here. I think we have to be back by 6.30. Yeah, I don't think we they, – they want us to watch the finale. I don't know why we have to watch the finale. So maybe we can – yeah. like they, Maybe to react to it. But what, what, would we react on the – Yeah, it's a little No, tight. no, but so it's like fresh in our – Oh, yeah, okay. When, All right. When we go live yeah. after. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little tight. Yeah, yeah that's, we, that's we, a – we can, we, can, we, can, we can probably do that. I was going to get a haircut. I, I can skip that. Yeah. No, that's, so just do a meeting. <clears throat> Yeah, but I mean, it's very rare he wants to go to dinner. So I true, think that's a, true, true. Well, other I, sign of righteousness. I, what? Oh yeah, I was a I was a dickhead. No, you didn't no, want to be seen I, with me. No, 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 no. Yeah, you missed what that. Go was. ahead. Go ahead. The way you phrase that is very rare. That I want to go out to dinner. Y- you want to go out to dinner? And I said okay. Yes. Right. Dave wasn't like hey. Willing whoa. is very maybe maybe replace the word wants to willing. Yeah, accurate. he's tolerating. Right, accurate. Dinner. Well, hey, f- for a long time. It, hey, Dave, you want to go to dinner? Fuck no. Rather oh, die. Why? We like, went to dinner, didn't we go? Yeah, to- yeah, yeah. But that was when I was light on the drugs. Then I really, yeah, so. Yeah. I'm fine with you saying it's very rare that Dave's willing to go to dinner. Not very rare right. that Dave wants to Agreed. go to dinner. Like if you're like, no, yeah, dinner, mo- and I most want of that is self inflicted. Oh, no, no, I agree. Dinner? Yeah, definitely. Well, I'm excited for it. I think it will go well. Yeah. It's been a good, it's been a good rehabilitation year. Pretty good. I I um. I have thoughts on in the dinner. I guess we'll talk about it. I I don't know how the dinner is going to go. Oh, I honestly don't. Why? Because I don't know what's going on in his head. I never do. I don't like that. No, I don't like that either. Yeah, why not? Yeah, positive. I. It could be. What do you think it's going to be? An ambush? What? No, I think sometimes you're Delulu, as the kids say. <laughs> Delulu. I was. That's what the kids say now. Yeah, like, I fucking love on. that. Delulu. <laughs> Delulu. Uh, yeah, I think I was, but I think you'll be Im- impressed with the opening monologue. Oh, I like that. You have notes, and then I, no, I, uh, when you say notes, well, have I driven around monologue. in my car and? <laughs> what? You said monologue. Yeah. When I've dri- have I driven around in my car and rehearsed it or uh, practiced it because you, you can get in the room with with the gladiator you can get rattled. Uh, so well, I'm not yeah. coming at this like a, it won't be a position of like um, I'm not trying to instigate or or right. I just think it's not, I think it's I, a very I think civil it's conversation. Not limited to you. I think there's just an overall sense of delusion amongst our company. Company wide, yeah. Yeah, the Delulu is high. Right. Yeah, I also think I've botched every kind of the, every one of these conversations in the past, so I can vow that I will not go in only trying to hit fastballs. Right. Like if I think I'm just gonna or out muscle everybody, like you can't, uh, it's, remember the Titans. You can't run past everybody in this league. Gary Bertier. So I feel well, like that's I, an yeah. admission that you might not have leverage. Well. Well, it's just good. He should yeah, know no, that that's because that that's is more rational. And I would also say, like, uh, it, uh, the number one, and this isn't necessarily a Rico thing, but it's a company-wide thing, is people want to eat before they're ready to totally eat. Like, we all, I feel like we're fair here. 
but it's like it just doesn't automatically happen. But I, I think I don't think you're going to be like when I say where I'm at, I don't think you're going to be like insulted at all. Like you're in the best place. This conversation, I'm happy to have it. Where in years past, I felt yeah, like I, you were very lucky to even be here. Yeah, I mean, I went in with a horrific attitude. Correct. Of comparisons and right, yes, so, delusional so, so different things, we, like and our relationship fixated on little things you, like you, that, and is, even is like just shifting in your is shifting in your benefit now, yes. where it's like we're starting to get the process where you'll be treated like a, 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 a rational adult, even though you're not, but like. You've had a good, especially, I would say, second half of the year. Yeah, it's like you're going into it knowing that you're maybe not talking to Rico Bosco. Maybe you're talking a little bit to the T-man. Yeah, a little yeah. bit, yeah. Yeah, which is a good thing, yeah. I would assume. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I always wanted to have, like I said, I think, you know, the the comparison or the statements, Dave's the fairest guy in the world. You've said that. A million other people have said that. 100% is. I haven't experienced that. And that's on my own accord. Because when you go in and you got the guy in a stranglehold, how do you expect him to be fair? Yeah. So I am now excited to see fair Dave. Who had who in a stranglehold? I had you in a stranglehold. Oh. Like the way I approached it. What? I don't think you did. No. <laughs> oh, okay. I think you had yourself in a stranglehold. Right. And I was and you're like, yeah, Dave, look at this stranglehold. Yeah, I have no yeah. yeah, there's I have yeah, no air yeah. going to my my but, brain, the oxygen. Well, yeah. Yeah. I was in a right. I, I was in a I was in a sand trap and or uh what are those things? Quicksand? Quicksand. And yeah. just tried to instead of trying to help out, I was just dragging people in. So yeah. Yeah. I'm excited yeah. for Fair Dave. I think Dave should be excited for non Delulu Rico. We'll see. It should be a non great Delulu meeting Rico. of minds. Fair Dave is 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 great. I remember I, I tell everyone when everyone's like, they ask me like, oh, yeah, like, how does it work with, you know, Barca was like the first, I think maybe the first year or the second year, like come Christmas time, I was like, I had a number in my head. Dave just called me. He's like, you're crushing it. And it, he just said the number first. and It was bigger. I was like, all right, that's fucking awesome. So, yeah. What are you going to eat? Oh, uh, yeah. You got to eat something pick, light. Dave's pick. Yeah. You got to eat something yeah, we light. Be probably close to the office. We'll have to have someone pick a place for us. There's, there's some really good places right around here. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Dave. Okay. I'm excited for this. You know, we might have some wrecks. Who? Oh. <laughs> Forgot he was here. Mincy, any recommendations for dinner? <laughs> okay. Diego. No, I'm not okay, doing all right, all right, all right, being all right, on camera. All right. Okay. 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 Who? Sushi? What's the coal fire pizza? Oh, coal fire pizza. We could do that. White, whatever you want. No, I'm not gonna do a pizza. <laughs> I do pizza every day. Fair. That picture of the boxes yeah. in your in your car is insane. People think it's easy. It ain't. We, we go we go on six seven hour journeys. Have you ever thought about just doing one bite? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but um. All right. Well, I'm excited for it. I also, Rico, we're not doing it here, which is good. That's a that's growth by me. I think that's fair. I've, yeah. I've asked no, that. I yeah, that no, I I appreciate it. Set the tone off for the Luluness. The Luluness, yeah. I mean, I know it's it was very incredible content, but this is I now agree. real life. Yeah. So yeah. Um okay. Uh let me take let me do one more ad and then we'll maybe start talking games. I'll just do it here. You wanna do it right now? This is a joke. Oh. Like, I was right. And there's nothing I want more. But yeah. I'm I'm respecting yeah, well, I, you. I, there's I literally you nothing that. I want more in life than for us to do this right laugh. now. Well, maybe but I'm being I'm trying to grow myself and and not have it be Give us a all right, give us a tease of the opening monologue. No. Come, Just give us like a No. Is it is it like I Luca Brazzi? Is it like uh hello Dave I got one, on the I, day I, of I, your I'm of your wife of your of your daughter's wedding? I hope your son is a masculine <laughs> yeah, son. I got one shot. Of it. <laughs> I, I'm gonna say this. I'm pretty confident your monologue has absolutely no <laughs> effect on on what the rest of the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> He's mad at Vinci for laughing. Uh, the monologue. Like, because like, you yes, the monologue doesn't change like the body of work or anything. It. it but what if he crushes it? The monologue? Yeah, what if it's like that? What if it's a what's if, what if it's a ten percent bump mon monologue? <laughs> you don't know. You don't know till you know. I, you know what? I will. Uh, I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna write what I think his number. Do you know his number? I do not. I'm gonna write what I think it is. Okay. And we'll we'll, we'll check we'll, back. We'll check back. Yeah. 
Just give us the first line of the monologue. Hello, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for, for, for yeah. taking me out to dinner. Are you going to pay? To, I, yeah, I'll pay. I think that's what he's going to ask for. Oh. That's a spicy meatball. I think that's what he's going to ask for. It's a spicy we'll meatball. We'll check back. I don't think he's going to. I'll tell you what I think he's going to ask for. <laughs> We're not doing this right now. <laughs> he's trying to, he's watching like what's written. He's trying to figure He saw out. the first number I wrote. Yeah. I think that's what he's going to ask for. <laughs> and that would be reasonable ish. Where, where, where? We're, we're far apart. Yeah. 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 Really? Who's higher? No, no, no. There's a Delulu number and there's a, a T Man number. The Delulu number. We're not saying. Unless you want to give us a monologue. If you want to do it now. We want to do it now. <laughs> Might as well do it now. Oh. I think it's no. I, like I said, I'm excited for <laughs> Rational Dave. Fair Dave. Why don't you want me to text? You want to text me what number no. you have? I can tell you which one was closer. I just want to know who's higher. So I know what I'm. And you can tell us. I want to know. I'm not going to tell you. And you, if you ask me after, I'm not going to tell you. I want to know who I'm going into the box. If you ask me right now. Well, I might what's tell it you. matter? We're both saying what we think you're going to ask. He's gonna, right. He's going to ask you 300 times before dinner. Yeah. I'm not going to say it because I don't want you, like, you got a number in your head. Yeah. What does it start with? <laughs> <laughs> I will say this. Otani's out for at least three months. Mm-hmm. And he got a bag. So, if you got a guy working around the clock. I don't know. I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> Do you want like an Otani deal such... where you get paid like twenty bucks a mu- a year <laughs> until like twenty twenty seven? Might as well just do it now. <laughs> that is one of the that is, a part of that is a bullet point, but I don't know if I'm gonna get to that bullet. Why don't you just say the number? We'll bleep it. You want to do the future pay? Like no, oh, no, no. Oh, so it's a complicated years. years. It's a complicated thing. Year, you could say the number. We could factor for you, or I just want. Uh, we could say the number. Right. We could bleep it, and you could get Dave's reaction. No. Okay. Because I think it all affects. I. Well, it doesn't though, because I. Think I, think, Dave, I think I think I think Dave has a number in his head. I don't think anything. That was his point about the monologue. I don't think anything. Correct. That right. is said is going to change yeah, yeah. what his. No, no, I don't is. think it's it's not one of those things where I I don't think it's going to change the number as well. It's more of a things that need to be said. Monologue. I think you've said everything you're going to say. If I had to guess, the monologue is going to be a, a decent amount of regret for the last three presidencies. With like you know now healthy debate, I I'm no longer on drugs. I see the future type thing. I think don't that- forget the the there's gonna be a lot of analogies to sports. Oh yeah, like I was I thought I was a starter, then I had to take a bench spot. Now I know I got a pass. I'm Might not as well trying to shoot as much. It's content. It is it you is incredible it. content. Yeah, I don't think there's much moving off of your number either way. So right, right, that's the thing. I do want the dinner though. And the dinner would actually be m- yeah, nicer. Be maybe a celebratory. It would be or like a, a fun anything. friendship yeah, dinner right. that doesn't not. have to. Maybe have... you won't want the dinner based on what happened. Who knows? Silent dinner. Yeah, maybe we take back you paying for dinner, or maybe you pay for dinner and Dave's flight home. <laughs> there's a lot on the table. <laughs> Look at me like I got cards in front of me playing poker. This is, this is good. I want, yeah, I want to see it, but I, 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 I think I'm just gonna stick to. I had a plan coming in. I'm gonna stick to the plan. It's good content. Okay. Is years is years of contract part of? Oh, the that's a good question. Not really. So is it is is it kind of like we know it's a one year? I actually, I would, I would estimate he. I, I think that's the way he's gonna. Go. I would think he would want a one year at this point. Yes, because I think that I think my num or the numbers that we've passed around. I think you want one year, and then maybe it becomes a bigger number. Because if you're truly seeing the light, it's like, okay, if I'm starting on the right path here, you know you're you're not at the end of one year. There's no jeopardy. We're in control of the company. And you put up a big number next year, you, you like the, if you do it, then you, you don't want to be tied in with a lower number. Right. So I would see a one year being in your benefit. 
Right. Which you've said in the past, too. Yeah. Like, hey, but to be honest, one thing most people say, the, the year contracts things don't mean a ton here because the, if someone outperforms it, it's generally like... It's ripped yeah, up. I mean, it's yeah. a, a little bit of... I've I never... I For Rico, for I, and obviously we're in different s spots, but I... The two things ha have happened to me. I, I'll never leave Barstool, but I've also I don't think I've ever even been close to free agency because every right. time that it needs to be ripped up, it gets ripped up. Yeah, I think it's just the sense of like not having to do it every year. To Dave's point, yes, it is beneficial, but it's yeah every year. But I think we're in a better spot than we were last year. We were, oh, like, you think? Dance, dance. Podcast. Yeah, I mean, you, you, last year you yes. weren't an employee. I, I agree. I agree. You all were. All, you were. Yeah, right. you were negotiating. Right. No, but I'm saying the whole thing. It starts in September or August, and it's like. Here we go. Dance, monkey boy. Dance for the We haven't. I don't think we've made you dance. I agree, yes. Because, this year? Also because I haven't acted like a fucking asshole. That's right. true. That's part yeah, of it. Yeah, that's absolutely Except true. Except for Jack. Yeah, that Agreed. was bad, calling him a cokehead. This is tough. We tease the audience. I know. Oh. They're just sitting here on the edge of their seat. Here, I'm going to do a rowback ad, and then you just think about it a little more. Rowback. It's safe to say we bet on these guys any day of the week because we absolutely love their gear. With the holidays quickly approaching, we only recommend rowback. It is simply the most comfortable Gear, we have a special guest coming in right now. Maybe we'll, that will help contracts. Uh, Roback's performance hoodies are the best piece of clothing we own. We can't emphasize how soft they are uh, with great stretch and still breathable. Roback's the best. Q-zips, polos, hoodies, joggers, shorts, vests, everything. Roback.com. Roback's been working with some of college football's biggest stars in Ohio State's Kyle McCord, Alabama's well, Jalen Milrow. Yeah, he he might not. He's not Ohio State. Anymore. No, he is. He might be Nebraska's Alabama's Jalen Milrow and Notre Dame's Audric Estime. Use code PICK on Roback.com for a generous twenty percent off your first purchase through the end of the week. That's spelled R H O B A C K dot com. That's twenty percent off all hoodies, crews, and joggers with code PICK. Roback.com. What's up, Skip? Kirk's here. Kirk Minahan. Come on, guys. We're we're just uh, we're playing a dance right now. We're doing this again? No, we're not. Oh, oh. It's, it's oh we're good. Very, we're done. Very healthy. No, it's no, it's been a very matter. civil, healthy. I had a plan going in, and I think doing a one on one at dinner. Wait, is cut, the cut the booth. Is the, yeah. Sorry, they were talking. The one on one at dinner is the healthiest way to do it. Good. Okay. When's that going to happen? That, tonight, that's I, tonight. But then we just started. Talking. Dave and I both wrote just down. Just one on one dinner. Yeah. Yeah. Dave and I both wrote down numbers that we think. Rico's going to ask for, and they're they're far apart, so yep. we don't know. You haven't made we, these numbers public. We've not no. made these numbers public. We, we offered to do it right now. Yeah, we said can we I would see, make it can public. Can I see these numbers or no? Yeah, you can see it, but, but we won't tell you which one. To yeah, Cirque secrets that you can't tell Rico. I swear. Right. I would, right. I would, no, yeah. no, that's fine. Um, I where's, should write. Where, where's yours, Dave? We're going to – you can't – we won't tell you who wrote which which number. Fair. Kirk is gonna come over here. Kirk, you might be able to. And we actually were done with it, and then we we Rico is like, he's thinking about maybe Go doing it right now because it is great content. Don't don't show Rico. Oh. Don't let him see. That's a significant difference. Yeah, there's yeah, a big they... difference. Do you know the number, Kirk? No, I, nope, I'm not. As no. his the agent, you don't. Kirk, the only number Kirk knows is a hundred thousand for once a week. Yeah. Right, he did offer you. That. <laughs> yeah, this is one of the all-time best. You want to and talk I about a guy down. being on drugs? He didn't yeah. know. The, he wow. didn't know, he, he didn't know our show was on Barstool. <laughs> well, no, <laughs> I, like I got fucked up. up and I was listening impaired, and I heard that you pay Mike out of his. I'm like, oh, he loves me. Like he'll pay me out of his pocket. Right, uh -huh. hundred up. grand. <laughs> <per. Fucked> up. <laughs> I know he did. It's fucked up. It's okay. I, I understand. So what would yeah. have that been a year like? He was saying the hundred grand for a year, for a year. Oh, to do oh, the show yeah. fifty two times. Yeah. I would bring yeah. him. I'd pay for transportation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah so yeah, one hundred fifty grand. So, um, I'm gonna guess that you went higher without knowing anything. Who, Dave? I'm not gonna say. I understand. I respect that. Yeah. Would you be comfortable if the number was the middle of those two numbers? No, I. I I already have my number in my head of he, what it is. Yeah, that wasn't his number of what he's going to. That's what we ask for. That's what no, we, oh, those are, what we, we think he's going to ask. He's going to ask for. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, I'm saying if the, if the number was the between those two. Is oh that, no, I I no, there's no. I know I have my number in my head. Okay. Those numbers were irrelevant to what I think he's going to ask. Well, like what the what, what it's going to be. Bit. Yeah. So it's going to be you two at five o'clock. So it's right or not, or right now we could. So to reiterate, there really yeah. is no nego <laughs> You're not moving off of your number. That's why it's like why why not? Yeah, it doesn't feel like a negotiation at that point. Oh, it's no, not really. No, right. there's no. not much. I I like right. I have a pretty good zeroed in ballpark of what 
and it's a small ballpark. It's like it's it's a it's a band box. Yeah, yeah. Ebbets Field. Yeah, popping yeah, yeah, them yeah. out. Well, okay. How are you feeling? Okay. Oh, like uh, the key to a yeah, negotiation post, but. in general is, uh, you know, Alex Cooper, Dan, Pierre, yes. like, well, we we got this these offers over here. I got it. It's tough to negotiate. Do you have this year another pretend offer from another radio right. station? <laughs> No, no, you don't. Oh, no, no, no. we played that card. <laughs> okay. I, I feel like that we could have we could have made that happen. Yeah, we could have gotten some <laughs> another, yeah some fake another, offers going on. Another Joker. Though <laughs> <laughs> so we count Jokers and hold them. Um, but that was the reason Does why the band box sit more than it currently sits. I mean, do you want to do this now? Yeah, this I'm been dancing around. It. But he, but the only reason that <laughs> I know change the whole day. Dave does know what he's going to – so that's the thing. is like the number's the number. So it's – like the squeeze, dinner's kind like, of irrelevant. We were saying like – oh, All I'm grand. saying is does the band box that, – that, 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 you know what I'm saying? Like, to does me, your band box fit more than it currently sits right now? That's a negotiation. We either do it at dinner or we do it now. Do it at dinner. So that's what I'm saying. Can you, will you squeeze, so we can squeeze maybe five. That's important, right? Yeah. yeah that's what I'm saying. So, like, yeah. Do we, do we up seating? Could he squeeze more out if he did it right now? Can he squeeze more if he makes another he, baseball? He knows reference? that it's content. Like the, the he, that's it, almost I, a sign of like I understand content. These are purely hypotheticals. Yeah, I mean you don't care really. No, nor do I. I do not care. I want to see everyone just be happy together. Sure, but if if he was like, yeah, you hadn't spoiled anything right now. No, we haven't said anything. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, well, yeah. do you see him? Right no, no, well, no, I'm just saying. I'm, I'm looking at the positives and the, I mean, again, I think that should be on somebody in production, not on this gentleman. But that's a different conversation. Were you here when I went out for production? <laughs> he oh, no, screamed. I was, of course, also not on your email because you don't. I'm, you still put me on company emails. That, I, that's that's <laughs> it's been four years. That's crazy. Well, that's <laughs> also you got taken off. I understand, but I've done enough now to be put back on. The guy <laughs> taken off when he's starting to sound like well, the guy I, sitting well, next well, to you yeah, right now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> rehabilitation. We don't need to tell the story. Again. Again. Yeah. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. But you're blaming. It's like. It's like when when little Harry Minahan was little, you know, he's in his thirties now. But when he was a little kid, <laughs> and he, when he was one, he'd poopy in his pants. Yeah, you, you two are sounding very similar. <laughs> what I'm saying is, you know, yeah, no, he can't. Light, yeah. He right. can't. He can't help himself. No. He's not potty trained in that way. I cannot believe he was on doing yeah. live streams That's out of saying. dump. That I was That's very clear. Yeah. That. No, I took a little ownership because I thought he was definitely on a dump button. I should have right. double checked that. Right. Because yeah, he's not. He's not capable of anything. No, no, no. He's, oh, he's capable of everything. He, right. He, right. That's right. right, right. <laughs> Twelve episodes, two international incidents. Seventeen I mean, percent. That's 17%. pretty good. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty good. This guy this year. I mean, Angel. Yeah. Yeah. He's a different. Done a great I'm job. At a different man, right? Here. Yeah. They said I couldn't do it. I did it for myself. Even his eyes are different. He's like Riggs. He's had the he surgery. Has, he, yeah. he is the yeah. true, true. Had to hit rock, rock, rock bottom. To Chris Heron. Yeah. Chris yeah. Heron. It's, I mean, he's Chris yeah. Heron. Yeah. He's on drugs. Yeah. 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 He's, I have Chris Heron's jersey. Right. Yeah. Exactly. Not if that helps or not. Yeah. But point is, well, I you know I root for comeback stories. Yeah. So there's just the two of you at five o'clock tonight. That's what the plan sounds like. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like we're not going to do it right now. I have something at four, but it's but it, it, if he did it right now, we would bleep out the number. Absolutely. So it would just be number reaction. Well, you. I'm sorry. You didn't answer his question. I don't think Dan's question. Would you be more open to negotiating in this form than say at dinner? Because it's content, and he's proving that he. Knows Maybe content. he'd have a very slight. There's no healthy debate. I, here, I, I, I honestly think you, you're. I think we're in a good spot. Good, good, fantastic. Then. Yeah, that, that I, I think it's good too. I don't think he. So like, I think you're still a little number. worried. Say your number. Just say hey, it. he'll react. We'll we will. Out. I we'll Hank. We will 100 percent bleep it out. There's no like I will. The dinner you, doesn't I'll put help my you. fucking we kids. Still go to yeah. dinner. I'll swear on my kids. The, the number gets bleeped the out. Yeah, the number gets bleeped out. Difference. Of like. You like me go, then you come back, and then I and then I yeah, but you, to, you keep like I rather like just I already yeah, have but my, he, there is no yeah, that's what he's I'd saying. rather just get that. Ball what's the part. first? What's the first number? I rather just get that ballpark to know like oh well, yeah because if it's this way you're not making. You I also think. respect like don't make a fool of yourself. But you're not going to get the ballpark tonight either. Like you're going to sit down to dinner and he's not going to say his ball number first. Five o'clock. Yeah, you're he's not going to say his number. No, that's not how. That's how you negotiate. Yeah. There was ne there's never a world where he's going to say a number first. 
if he did, I I'd be very inclined to not come back with anything. I still don't think that changes. If he gave you, think if he gave like you a if number, what well, the number was? If low, he's though. saying that if you said the number, he'll if just he, accept if he gave whatever. Number, it's one of those things. Like, do I really want to go down this road of, of fucking poking, poking? No, poke, but we're at a or, different spot. Hey, that's spot. a good number. Yeah, we're not buying a car here. I'm okay. just take take the number. Like, so yeah. what's your number? Dinner. Cover up your mouth when what? you say it. Dinner. Cover up your mouth when you say it. If you say it right now, cover up Dinner. your mouth. Yeah. What does I mean, it start with? The dollar sign. Okay. I think you should do it now. We've already gone this far. It's almost unfair to people listening. Yeah, just let's just do it. Because we've talked about it for half. You done. have your agent here. This will be done. I think it'll I think it's gonna I, done. I think it's be done very quickly. It's eleven fifteen. I think it'll, it's gonna be, it'll be very be quick. Minutes. It'll be done in ten minutes. If you if your if your number's reasonable, which I know it will be. Just do it. Yeah, again, I really don't yeah. I don't want to make myself look like an asshole. But we're going right. to bleep the number. The number's bleeped. The, the number, number will not be out in the this. podcast. That's a pr- I, I, if I think it's ridiculous, I'll I'll postpone it to dinner. Oh, that's yeah. fair. So that's if you actually a number. I'm like, we're going to dinner. That's fair. And then we just go right to the games. That's fair. That actually is fair. Okay. Cover your mouth. Yeah, I guess I could go on the low end this way. Or... Well, do what you well, do what you think you're worth. Don't don't yeah don't short. I'm not gonna do it in a mocking way. If the yeah. numbers like I know there's a lot of discussion that has to be done. You say number, I'll say dinner. We'll go into the games. Let's get a calculator out. I wish we had like a side bet on who's closer. Our number, like if we had that as a on the on like a sports book, your number versus mine. I bet you a thousand bucks that cash. You think. Yeah. I would actually. All right, fine. All right. I'm actually would like to. Okay. I don't know who's the suit because yeah. I would like to get on this. At least I have a thousand bucks cash. I have a good feeling about this. I think. This calculator is burning right now. <laughs> What's he He's doing? His workout. He's peaking. Beautiful mind. This is good. Everyone's pe- look at what Liam. Get everyone in there. That's look fine. at him. They're all peaking. Yes, that's fine. All right. So, we'll, I mean, we'll do a round number. All right. Cover up your mouth when you say it. Because that way, we're going to bleep it anyway. Good. But just so yeah, people but I think don't, I just people can't. I, I might have lowballed myself. I don't, I don't know what you want me to say. Fair. I, okay. Say okay. It. Okay. Then, then then bump it up well, a little. Hold on. Well, well, Remember, you get a little mind. bit of bump from doing it right here. Yeah, right. So, so I, by right. the way, Go, you know there, there's, you know, as Dan told the story before, when he said his number and ours, like, I if so, I'm yeah. not. If somebody gives me a number, I think they're worth more than the number. Right. I don't. I yeah, don't. That's cut fair, Dave. to see. That's happened totally twice to me, where I've said a number, and Dave's like, "You're totally worth fair. more than that." Totally fair negotiating. I will say that about Dave. Yes. I'm happy Kirk's here for him. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. This is fucking great, Mincy. Turn around. You don't get to enjoy this content. You do not get to enjoy this content, Mincy. In between, <laughs> this, is, this is a mound visit right now. <laughs> All right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cover up your mouth when you say it, because we're gonna bleep it. I don't want people to be able to well, no, guess no, no. what you're Throw saying. Me a pen. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. You got a pa- paper? Yeah, dinner. I, there's still some things to iron out at dinner, but this will. Be yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, and again, dinner could be celebratory. It could be could friendship. Be. It could be. I'll go. It could be a big. Yeah, night. it could be just everything. You take us all to dinner to celebrate, right, Dave? Yeah, if we all get right. this thing done. Don't do that. No, you can't, well, don't, but, but be a good... It's crazy. Change your face. Good faith. Done. Done. We're done. Wow. We're done. Say yes. Say yes. Don't fuck this up. Don't, don't, don't do this. Okay. Don't okay. do it. Dinner. Done. Shake hands. Go shake hands. We'll go... go shake hands. We can, we can do everything else. No, you didn't. You didn't. Yeah, no, that's a that great, that's a no, great no, deal. That is a that's great deal. Go shake hands right now. We're that's done. a great we're fucking done. deal. That's a great fucking we'll all deal. Go to dinner, unless you have stuff to ask me, prior, But oh man, we go to dinner, Rico, we I, Rico. Rico. So here, he, he, Dave owes me a thousand dollars. He owes me a thousand dollars. Hold on, Rico. Look, you went high. I went, I went low. High. I told you you went. That's yeah. what I said. Well, you I high. thought he was going to come in. Show to Lulu. Well, no, actually, I don't want to show. No, no, show. Well, yeah, yeah show. I do don't, think. But no, that was no. also just what we thought he was going to come. I almost yeah. nailed it, Rico. So I think that's a great deal, and Rico. He was lower, by the you're way. High, you're higher than what I guessed. Put the calculator down. It's over. You made a good deal. Yeah. You made a good deal. You it's know a, what's fitting? What? 16%. Oh, 
Ooh, Mincy. It's fu- Mincy's fuck ups. Sixteen percent of the time he fucks up. Wake up, That's, Mincy. Uh, the, the bump. Yeah, the bump. I think. I think I think it was a little low, but it, like, no, I don't. Oh, no, I don't, no, I don't, no. no, this no. Thing you had all year. You, no, good deal. This is I don't think oh, you that, were low. That, that was right about. Yeah. On. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. That's what I figured. That's Rico. What I that you almost you almost hit exactly what I guessed. And don't forget. And you were actually a little higher than that. So don't forget you haven't been there, but almost everybody content gets sizable bonuses based on how they do. On well, the that's uh, that's on a bullet point. Okay. Yeah, but that, that's like a, yeah, but that's a, that's a that's how it works. So it's a base a, salary, and then that's you, a, correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah a, bonus. A, a base salary, yeah, and then I was, you'll get. Yeah, a, yeah, I, mean, I, 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 I was remember that was that's that like was Chase Dan to his call. Yeah, that was bad. In a full Iowa sweatsuit when Wisconsin was playing. Like, yeah, another dickhead move. That's why I don't think. You, that's why I don't think you lowballed. Just that, no, Kirk. Right. Last year, he yeah. It, yeah, after was, everything that happened, he he chased me in my car, and he's just like. So no bonus for me this year. Like Rico, you you quit to a month four weeks ago. Yeah. Yeah, so it's done. I feel really good about that. I think that's a great deal for you, Rico. Like, I'm happy for you. You deserve it. You've done a great job this year. That's fucking. I, I thought it. W- I I I thought you're gonna come in the Lulu higher, but I thought in the end you'd be happy like that. I'm. I knew I'm happy. great job. Yeah, I, I'm happy for you. Yeah. And like I said, it wasn't gonna change much. That's like where it should be. That's right. Right. And Rico, think about it. A million and a half dollars a year is a lot in Staten Island. Agreed. <laughs> Big time. <laughs> oh, that's what, oh, that's what he just signed for. Oh, I just realized the decimal what he asked for. That's low. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. No, that's good. I was I, joking. That, that's a joke, Rico. That was a, kidding, that Rico. was a, a a good sign of everything. I yeah, I think the, that was great. Good negotiation by the skin. very good job. You Talk got him over. Down, you got, got him ready spot, to go. Right. Yeah. What? What? Oh, no, 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 yeah, yeah. no! Don't do. This. Oh no! Don't do this. Don't do this. Oh don't no! Do yeah. It's a li- yeah. Here's the go- I got a little bit of that thing at War Dogs where they're like, "Hey, I gotta ask, why'd you give us the deal?" It's like, "Well, you guys were fifty three million dollars lower than everybody." But I don't else. do that. No, I don't he think doesn't do no, that. I, I know, but I think in that ballpark, yeah. I- Rico, I'm telling you, God's honest truth. Two times, because it's been what like twelve years now. So there's been many times when Dave and I have, have sat down. Two different times, I can see in my head where I've said a number. Dave's like, "You're worth more than that." Yeah. So it's not like he's like, "Oh, I'm gonna just." Oh, you said a number? Great. I can get you for cheap. That's how he works. It is hard. It is hard to define like what base salary is for well, some, well, yeah. some of it. It's just yeah. it is. Like, a lot. Right. Like like I have the numbers and well, but this, Dan Dan's in a unique spot right, sure, because they have very clear right. ads and, and there's right. people in the company who it's very easy. Oh, we make this much on it. Yeah, of course. The, the, Rico, along with a lot of people, aren't there yet. Hopefully, healthy debate gets to a point where it's like, oh, stands on its own. Correct. Or uh, rea- or reality shows. Reality shows are huge. I talked to Kirk about that. That is a hard thing to quantify. That's a big reason why I'm still here. But but yeah, it that we have to get more at using the cast who may not have the individual shows that have the clear P and L, but we make it on you know when we get the golf together or we get the you know. Well, that, yeah, that's, bar that's a bullet point, too. You want to be in the Ryder Cup? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm out then. <laughs> I didn't realize that. We get, And we got to be better at selling those. Like, yeah. That's a whole yeah. different conversation. Yes. But, but, I mean, yeah. All right, yeah. yeah I think it's uh, it's just ironing out. Yeah. Small, very this small. Is celebra- this is celebration. It is. Dinner. Celebration of life. This is not it's a man that looks like No, it's not. It's not a happy look, yeah, though. Even, I, don't, I mean, this is a big I don't win think for you. you th- I don't think you thought that piece of paper was going to have yeah, I think you still thought it was going to be Delulu. Well, I didn't know what, what my... I wouldn't have let you put that... Uh, no, I wouldn't have let that happen. I also wasn't going to, in fairness. I know, I know, I but I'm just saying that was... Up, you, the, no, the things you were seeing were not crazy now. I know, I know, but I'm just saying... A, no, that, he, that, that, gone, that was fair. And that's over how many years, that salary? One, okay. Oh, I thought that'd be three years for that total, so okay, <laughs> you're really overpaying. <laughs> Jesus, wow. I thought that was a three-year Good deal. job, Rico. I'm Rico, proud of you. Congratulations. Like, that's good. That's Thank good. You, yeah. It's done. Now you're done. Now you can relax. Also, right. you just said 16% is like, I mean, that's-, that's I can already that's, tell you. That's the Delulu of this company. Right. Like, yes. You give right. raises and right. they look like, at it's it. It's only 16%. Like, yes. Right. I've had that conversation. I only got 10% raise. Like, right. well, you look at the world. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. No, we're in right. a recession. Thanks, Joey B. Yeah. Sleepy Joe, sure. Get, Sleep at the wheel. Five o'clock. Yeah. yeah. You got a pick for us, Kirk? Before we so now it's a group dinner. Is that okay? Yeah. Are you okay with that? You're not. Uh, okay? I could do two skips. Yeah. Oh, I'm out. 
Okay. No Dan? No, he didn't want that. Even this whole thing, he's still kind of like. I wasn't. Wait. I, like the paraplegic I, Goodfellas. I was. Can't help if we play back the tape, oh, there, I was very oh, much not. Staring at airplanes and stars. I was oh, trying was not to do this. He was in the room. Yeah, if you do replay it, we were done with the conversation. Yes. And you said something. Yes. I was I very to, much like, don't I've do it. I erased content. But no. That right. But don't. This no, that's not true. It just was. It was more of, I don't want to make myself look like an asshole. No, that wasn't. How would Rico. that be an asshole compared to the what the things you were doing in the past? There have been many times where I will absolutely cop to poking, 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 poking. Many, many times. I don't think if you replay that tape, I poked it all. No. That was a, there was an right. awkward silence that then began. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah, I agree. I don't have to come to dinner. I'm not wanted. He's not. You don't want you. If you want to go with just Dave, I don't care. Yeah, let him go with just Dave because we actually yeah. had this conversation. You just go. You and yeah, Dave. You guys, yeah, you guys right. have a celebration. We're good. We're in a good spot. Right. Yeah. yeah. Go on. Kirk, you and I will yeah. go to dinner. We'll go to dinner. We'll go to the same place they go. We'll sit one yeah. table over. I'd like to have dinner with you tonight. That'd be yeah, fun. let's do That'd it. I, mean, I feel like we're not. It's hurtful. What? Oh, I mean, you and I. I mean, I help get this deal done. No, you a thousand percent can go. No, it's fine. I'll be by myself again. It's fine. Not big. <laughs> There's a Jimmy John's on the street. All right, fair. All right, give us a pick, Kirk. You're the best what? gambler. Any college football game. Well, I mean, I got to go with my guy, Nick Saban. Oh. I mean, champions are champions. Like, I, don't, like, I would say Alabama, 34, Michigan. <coughs> I'm going to put a million cash. I'm rooting for you, all kidding aside. I, I got to actually do that today, probably. I keep waiting for What's the number now? It's, it's, it's minus one, I think. It's still on the, on the different account. I've seen it on different. You got to take money now. line. Yeah, okay. Well, well, not at one, now. I want it. Rico, no, one, on. you don't have to. Oh, well, that would just be all time. Well, no, you wouldn't care. Thank you, Kurt. If what? you didn't, if you pushed one, no, no, yeah, I won't right. Care. It's one, um, minus one twenty. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. And it's minus one, minus one fifteen. Minus one twenty is a is lot. the money line, yeah. But oh, oh, that's money line. Yeah, minus one twenty money line, minus one, one minus one fifteen on okay. just the spread. Okay. But yeah, that was over, and Rico said, "Should we do? Just do it on the show?" Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know. It's, I guess, a little nerve. I know I you want, want a celebratory dinner. Rico, I also want to say I do not take offense to the fact I think you want to have dinner just solo with Dave, and I respect yeah. that. That's You You should go do that. You think so? I don't know. Especially because... I don't know what that means, but... <laughs> <laughs> I, true. No, so Michigan here, they're minus 115 minus oh. one. So that's all a fucking lot of money when you're... Yeah, that's big. 50 grand. Yeah. Um. Do you, So before we do the games, do you want to... I mean, you can do the monologue. <laughs> no, I still probably <laughs> okay, all right. there, to be honest. Just save the monologue. All right, yeah. let's talk games. That was great. I'm happy for you, Rico. That's a great deal. Right. I'm, I'm being honest like, with yeah. you. That's a great deal. I also still think there's a little still a little water in that rock, maybe. So have to still the good. That old laugh is old school. Yeah. Sick laugh. Crazy laugh. <laughs> I still got it. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's do games. Yeah, we let's do games. Let's take a quick break from Pick'em and tell you about Nutrafol. You don't have to choose between better hair growth and your health. Nutrafol provides a whole body health approach for men that promotes healthier hair. No drugs, no compromises, just better hair. Nutrafol is the number one dermatologist recommended hair growth supplement, clinically shown to improve your hair growth, visible thickness, and visible scalp coverage. Nutrafol's hair growth supplements use physician formulated, natural science backed ingredients. Their drug free, patented technology provides consistent, reliable results without compromising your sexual health. Go to Nutrafol.com slash men to take their hair health wellness quiz. Identify causes of your thinning hair, and Nutrafol will give you a personalized plan for better hair health through whole body wellness. Nutrafol supports healthy hair growth from within by targeting root causes of thinning, such as stress, hormones, environment, nutrition, lifestyle, and metabolism through whole body health. And it works. In a clinical study, 84% of men showed improvement in their hair after six months taking Nutrafol's hair growth supplements. Take the first step to visibly thicker, healthier hair. For a limited time, Nutrafol is offering our listeners $10 off your first month subscription and free shipping when you go to Nutrafol.com slash men and enter promo code PICK. Find out why over 4,000 hair care professionals recommended Nutrafol for healthier hair. Nutrafol.com slash men, spelled N-U-T-R-A-F-O-L dot com slash men, and enter promo code PIC, P-I-C-K. That's Nutrafol slash men, promo code PIC. Obviously, we didn't have a show after uh, the college playoff was announced. So, Florida State out. Uh, Bullshit. 
bullshit. Rico, you'd get half credit. You did say that that was going to happen, but then obviously you said it before Jordan Travis agreed. got hurt. Yeah, agreed. I remember when people were like, yeah. yeah but, Jordan- well, I did say I was the first guy, I feel like, to be like, watch, it's going to be complete chaos here and somebody's going to get fucked. I didn't think it'd be Florida State, but I thought it'd be Texas. But looking back, like Texas, yeah, yeah, Texas, Texas and Bama are a package yeah, deal. Right, yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, and then... Um, I will say this. I think the committee got it wrong leaving out Florida State, but they gave us the best four. Yes. So, and that's the crutch they're always going to have. And they're like, you're going to watch anyway. Shut up. So... It's a ratings game. Yeah. It's true. Tough year. Well, too, yeah, for because... New, for New Year's I, I will never... Like, to me, and I said this, I will never, uh, pay, like, pay attention or give credence or actually credibility. I, if, if you're 13 and you don't get in at 12, I don't care. Right. right. Like, but... It's going to be two losses versus three losses. Yeah, at that right. Point. Who like, cares? you had a chance to do something. You cry me a river. I don't care about that snub. But Florida State, what are you going to say? You play a perfect season. Uh, it, it kind of defeats the purpose of sports. It sucks for the kids. Yeah, right now we would be debating like Oklahoma, LSU, and Arizona. Right. Tough year for uh, it, New Year's Day. It's essentially a school night. You got we're back into work on the second. The way it falls on that Monday. I always hate when New Year's Day is what? When New Year's Day is a Monday, and you go back on the second. Think about it. we're gonna be up till twelve thirty watching these games. Yeah, no, I like that. School I prefer night. that though. That's way better. It's like after. It's way better than it has been before. It's been on like Christmas Eve. No, it's, New Year's or New Year's Eve. Eve, Eve excuse yeah. me. You know this. That was this, the worst. You have That's your New Year's. Down. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's New Year's. Then you just don't even get. Well, out I just of meant bed. the fact that you you're order, up to. You're gonna be up till one two in the morning. You got to go to work tonight. Let him finish, Dave. Yeah, you're right. I apologize. You're. <laughs> uh, you. <laughs> New Year's Eve, next day, a little hungover, order a ton of food, sit, and just watch football all day. That's how it used to be. Every, yes. Oh, yeah. It's, it's like the biggest day out. of the year. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, you're right. You Chinese food guy on New Year's let Day? Let him finish. Love, love it. Let, let Rico finish his so, day. Anyways, please. I like the games on New Year's. I'm very – It's a school night. We all go back to work the second. That's yeah, tough. Year? No. Depends when it falls. Well, yeah, that's most of the time, unless it's like because if it was, let's say, if it was, if New Year's Day was a Thursday, you think he would make us go back to work on Friday the second? No. If it was Wednesday, he might give us Thursday, Friday. Like it's it's the way the week falls. Do you know what is bullshit though? You know what's bullshit that's gone away? Right. The fact that we don't have uh, any bowl games on that Tuesday, Wednesday after New Year's. That's bullshit. You need the come down games. They used to do. No, but that's that's kind of new too, relatively. No, because no, because they changed it. You because, mean the shit games? No, they used to always do like the Peach Bowl. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah like yeah, on the yeah, Tuesday yeah, night, yeah. and it would be like a, like a top fifteen yeah, matchup. Right. They've taken away that. But because, that is like I I miss when just everything was on New Year's. Like there was yeah. nine thousand yeah, games yeah, on New yeah. Year's. Yeah, but I I do miss the come down games. Like I need a couple bowl games on Tuesday and Wednesday because we have this whole like stretch where I'm just betting football all the time, and then they just cut it from you i feel like new year's i always remember it's like 11 a.m tennessee iowa yeah like always that's that's literally doing, this year is it are, yeah tennessee it iowa is. yeah do they play like every year <laughs> yeah they're Clubs. playing they're playing in the citrus bowl yeah that's why yeah. that bowl yeah the 11 a.m yeah yeah iowa. no the, the one you're talking about is wisconsin lsu what bowl is that's that? the 11 a.m uh, Bowl. it's the what it was was the camping the camping world the outback bowl thank you mincy it's now rely a quest bowl Got it. But yeah, um, I'm so jealous of you, Dave. By the way, that you're going to the Rose Bowl. It's the greatest football experience it's ever. A huge game in my life. It's I I have everything. This Super is, Bowls are obviously bigger. Where where is is this bigger than one of the Super Bowls? No, maybe? no. Super- because I'm a bigger Patriot fan than I am right. Michigan. But like, this is the this is the jewel that I'm missing in my championship. Yeah, round. Thanos. All of them. Yeah, you got all of them. Super yeah. Bowl though is when you would go to Super Bowls. Like that's business. This is like you're gonna get romantic about football. Well, college like basketball, that's what it feels basketball. like. You just see it. College football, Rose yeah, Bowl. Yeah, but I, 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 that, that is not on the same crown as me. Like I, that's distant. If you said I can get a football <laughs> national championship or a college basketball championship, they're they're very different to me. And we really did have one. We got fucked. But uh, no, I, I'd Ooh. much rather win. It's also. A lot of stakes for you because you, in years past, if this game was happening, you'd be like, well, Patriots playoffs. Yeah, the Patriots are dead. Right. So now it's like 
you got a long you winter. Camp bigger at Michigan, Alabama, and the Rose Bowl. That's oh, get bigger. Massive. Than that. It's gonna be great. All right, should we talk a few games and then we'll do a couple picks? So uh, there's Arizona Bowl, obviously. Arizona Bowl's on the list. I put that on there. Everyone, tune in. CW and Barstool TV on uh, December thirtieth. I think it's two o'clock local time, four o'clock uh, Eastern time. Saturday, December thirtieth. Are you checking? Uh, no, I was checking something else for a recommendation, but yeah, I'll get you the game. Hold on. No, I, I, I'm pretty sure I got it. All right, let's talk a couple other games. Uh, these are just like the the big bowl games leading up. Mizzou and Ohio State. Uh, Ohio State has everyone transferring. Everyone. Ryan Day. You- I actually believe the rumor that he's like soft launching his NFL career. Like trying to figure out yeah, if someone to, would get him and get him in dodge. chaos. Um, I, for that reason, I'll take Missouri because everyone's playing and they're ready to go. I think Ohio State is chaos, like you said. Uh, I think it's also going to be high scoring, so I'm going to take Missouri in the over. Yeah, I'm going to take Missouri too. Yeah, the Ohio State situation, like I do think they'll be fine long term because they're Ohio State, but right now they feel like they're at like a weird crossroads where it's like what's – What's going to happen here? They've gotten the piss beat out of them three straight times. Yeah. What was that base? Uh, Grand Canyon has a home game, but it's the same day. I thought it was the night before. It's an unreal experience out in Arizona. Huh? I would not you be going, going to that. Okay. No, I'm just I'm saying I'm not. Fair enough. That, I appreciate that. It's nuts. It's like a- I've gotten actually weirdly lucky with the Arizona Bowl because – Ordinarily, I wouldn't want to fly to the West Coast, but Michigan's out there again. Last year was a debacle, yeah, obviously. You're, uh, yeah. yeah, you hit a home run with that. Um, all right, other game. I'll take uh, Mizzou in that as well. You got Mizzou? Okay. It's uh, bad. You could have got two and a half, or minus two and, and a half. half. Yeah. Yeah, you're not really playing, but. This is the thing. I I will still bet every single bowl game. Crapshoot. It you really does suck. Right you should it's... live bet every single one of them. Yes. yes. Watch like yes. one series of each and see who's trying, who's playing, but. I, even though I know that's the right move, I mentally can never do that. Yes, it's it's it sucks how the portal and everything has changed it yeah. so that portal there's, is there was no that idea. famous bowl when Houston came in, and they were playing Army, and it was in somewhere in the middle of Texas that nobody gave a fuck about or whatever, and Army goes right down their throat the first one, right down the second, and it's very clear like Houston does not want to get cut yeah. blocked here for three hours. Yeah, like let's just get out of here, not die and whatever, and Army just pounded them. Yeah. Uh, all right. That was very famous. Uh, famous in the sense it fits the live betting. Right. You could have made a fortune. Yeah. Uh, Ole Miss, Penn State. Penn State's minus three and a half. Over under is 48 and a half. <sighs> Any intel on Ole Miss? You I don't. talking to me about it. In the- Thanks, uh, Can you come talking to a mic. Talk into a mic. Give the people here. Is that? Yeah. Okay. Oh. All right. Penn State's defensive coordinator took the Duke head coaching job. The tap top pass. Manny up. Diaz. Yeah, Manny Diaz, top pass rusher opted out. I heard they're going to have more opt-outs. Ole Miss is playing everybody and fired up about it. So, I like Ole Miss on the tower. And Ole Miss is better athletes. I Ooh. actually like Ole Miss. I think I'm going to take Ole Miss plus three and a half then. Ole Miss. I like them, yeah. I like them before that speech, but I, I do like them. Yeah. All right. Uh, Georgia, Florida State's the last. Oh, and then we'll talk Arizona Bowl. But Georgia, Florida State, uh, Florida State's plus 14. I'm going to take Florida State in this game. I I don't know. I feel like they're going to have the, the biggest, like, rallying cry of all time yeah this type it, of game. it's tough i i'm taking florida state too but i don't i have no idea what to expect out of them i think it is they could rally or they could be deflated i think george is deflated yeah i always think the team that's just got their uh life cut out from under them they, they went from number one never lost they play for national championships i don't think they play for this game so i just think you're gonna get a subpar georgia effort I have no idea what to expect. Florida State, who knows? But I'll take the points. The thing, too, with Florida State is I know they looked bad against Louisville, but that was their third-string backup. Yeah. The Rodemaker kid's not – he's not great, but he's he's at least competent. And Florida State's defense can play with anyone. I, yes, I agree. And there's been countless examples, I feel like, of SEC teams. Yeah, because they were, get the benefit of like, oh, we didn't try. Or if they win, they're like, see, yes, yeah, it's better. Yeah, right, who, who are in line for the playoff – and then they don't make it, and they just lay down in the in their next game. What do you got, Rico? Uh, I'm gonna go with Florida State. Okay, I agree. I think this they'll rally. Listen, Georgia's still kind of the big bad wolf, um, but do they really give a fuck in this? 
Like I they really care was, if Florida State only, wins a fucking think, fake championship. Yeah, that's what I was just saying. I agree. Yeah. Yes, I agree. The only argument you could make with with some of these bowl games in a team like Georgia is they have so much fucking so many dudes on that roster, freshmen, sophomores yeah. that are going to be the next dudes, and they can use this game as their launching point for yep. next year. That's it. Uh, all right, our bowl game, Toledo, Wyoming. Wyoming's coach is retiring. Yeah. Daquan Finn is out for Toledo. I don't know how you can't bet Wyoming. Wyoming. This is I love that coach, too. He's off. Craig Bull. Plus out west. What? Yeah, they Toledo travel. going yeah. all the way. Yeah. They oh, travel. Well, Wyoming's in the area. Yeah, yeah, no. I'm yeah. bad with directions, but Wyoming, I mean, Wyoming. traveled. They they had, like, yeah. a full house last year. Yeah. Yeah. No, I mean, I'm. are we going to be on the same side in this game this year? Sounds it. Yeah. I, I just don't. I mean, that, that coach retiring is like, he's been there forever. I also like the over. Ooh. Yeah. Even though. Daquan yeah, Finn's I think out. Wyoming puts up a lot of points. Okay. Um, all right. Let's talk uh, the semifinal games. The first one is Texas-Washington. I am now staring down a doomsday scenario because, as we've talked about on the show, I put a future on Washington, cashed it out for a profit, took the profit, put it on Oregon, picked the wrong horse. Jaden Daniels made it a little bit better because, in a weird way, I, I'm never good at like figuring out math and hedging. Jaden Daniels actually ended up being a hedge against – like Oregon not right, winning right. that game. Um, so won a little money there. But, yeah, if Washington wins, it's going to be an all-time fuck-up by me. You were a little hot. Are you mad about the Washington tie? I did, in fairness, Dan, I tried to jinx Happy him, brought it not up. jinx well, what, you. What did you. What did you have them at? I had Washington at 18-1 to 1 for 5K. They beat Oregon. I cashed out for 12K, then put 5K on Oregon at 25-1. to 1. Yeah. Right. So I still ended up so it, up seven yeah. grand or whatever. Or no, so you would have won if your bet was just standing. You had a chance to win ninety. Yeah. 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 So it it hurts. Yeah. It hurts a lot. But then I had Jaden Daniels plus five fifty for five k. So a little bit back yeah. there. But yeah, it hurts. It, w- it will be an all time blunder by me because I'll have to go look at it and be like, that's the ticket well. I we just need up. Texas. I, I let, Texas. I'll start. I, I love Washington. I love them. I I I've been I I've been on them now for a bit. I, watching them, there's always teams that you start to see evolve. I don't think they're getting the respect. Their defense is playing much better than it did in the beginning of the season. And they're a chameleon team, which just finds ways to win. They that I don't even, that Oregon game wasn't even that close. They brutalized. Them. No, they it was it looked like Oregon essentially just read the power ratings that everyone had, and they're like, we'll show up and win. That why I texted you. I go like five minutes in the game. It was clear who wanted to be there. Not wanted to be there, but who is more physical, dominant. I am not sold as much as people in Texas. Washington underdog again. I think they win this game. Um, and I think they can win the whole thing, to be totally honest. I like Washington. Yeah. So what Rico was alluding to, um, I forgot about this completely. So I guess yeah, that, answer, it, that yeah. answers the question that uh, am I over it? Yeah, because I forgot about it. Fair. But I just went and looked back. Uh, so I play, I just told everyone what my future situation was. If you remember, when I had the Washington future, we called his friends uh, Sally. Sal- yeah, yeah, Sal- I remember that. And I said that if Washington makes it to the final, I believe, or was it to the playoff? It yeah, might have been to the little, playoff. So he said college football finals. Okay. Well, I said I think I said playoff. I will give Sally 1K. Yeah. So I had forgotten about this. Sally got ahead of himself. And uh, well, Mid-game. so did you. Uh, Rico texted me in the middle of the fourth quarter uh, <laughs> with a text from Sally being like, "This should be brought up on Pickham." The fact that Big Cat owes me a thousand dollars, and Rico texted me, "Expensive night for you." In the middle of the fourth, trying quarter. to reverse jinx. That doesn't no, really. No, Sally feel like said. A- Sally texted with eyeballs, Washington eyeballs, and the game wasn't over. And Oregon's making that run. I'm like, all right, here we go. Dan says, come in his hole. I'm fucking jizzing all over the place here. Sally got ahead of himself. I don't care if Sal wins a thousand. Let's get Dan to the window one time. One but time. saying expensive night for you, like how is that? Because it, that, how is that a jinx? Because I'm all I'm saying it's just me. it's over. Yeah, it was a very We're mean both, thing to do. I'm yeah, sitting there watching the, the the jump that I made was brutal it to was watch. Reverse jinx. And he wrote expensive night for you. Yes, the it, reverse jinx. I was also that's, acting. How like, is that a reverse? Because jinx? I was acting like Washington won as well, and then the gambling gods. It's very much Nikki Smokes. I was trying to put the checkbox. I don't think. Then so. it comes back on us, and Oregon wins. I don't. This, think this so. is quack quack quack. That reminds me of another. I don't know if Jerry told you this exchange. We no, had. I just went back Sunday, oh. November twenty sixth. I had a hundred grand on Gerard? the Bills. 
Oh, I think he did tell me this. Yeah, yeah. It, but yeah. The Bills versus um Jerry Thornton or Gerard? Gerard. Um Jersey Jerry. Jersey Jerry. Um He's got a very popular show called Jerry After Dark. He's doing well. So but I thought they hundred grand Jerry. on I had the Bills that Eagles. Thank you. Vincey <laughs> Vincey just sitting I, here. I lose that bet and I'm ice cold. Hundred grand. Bill should have won that fucking game. And I get this at eight twenty five. The game was over for twenty five minutes. Do you want to give up on that Mac Jones bet? He's bad, <laughs> That's Dave. Right. They need to draft a QB. I wrote back, read the room, midget. Oh. <laughs> he he did tell me this. I was like, why would you do that? Crazy. Rico did the same thing to me. Expensive night for you. Yes, I tried to reverse That's jinx. That's not a reverse jinx. I don't know how you could read that as a reverse jinx. Just look lost at this. 100. This is this is the this is the text that he sent. So this is him and Sally. Sally said, uh, this better be brought up on Pick'em. Is that what he said? And he said, Yeah, LOL, I will. Rico sent me that text exchange and just said expensive night for you. Yeah, that's that's not, not a reverse that's jinx. A that's reverse. just a fucking sticking that's, it to me yeah, when I'm down. Yeah, that's tough. And then I, I demanded Rico got great. I could tell Rico got scared because I just wrote back, What's his Venmo? You're always sick with your timing. And he's like, Don't flip out. And I said, What's his no, Venmo? No, no. Give it to, I said, give it to me right now, otherwise he gets nothing. Dan. So then I I got the Venmo and I sent him a thousand dollars right away. You are misreading the text for the record. Okay. Hank. The Halloween costume with Max's tweet, that engine. You're talking at the air. You're talking there. Engine or truck, this better be brought up on Pick'em. That's the end of that conversation. Then it starts a new one. Oh, so it's just, just the, the Huskies? Washington. Just the Huskies. Okay. Just the Huskies. But still, expensive Down night for you is not... How is that because a reverse jinx it was, whatsoever? I, then I needed to be the. I needed to also be on Washington, so the gambling gods come back on both of us. But in reality, I'm really rooting for Oregon. If you had texted me saying, Sally's getting ahead of himself, that would have made sense. Expensive night for you is like... You're right. Like, hey, I remember this guy you owed thousand dollars to? Get better text. All bets better have been paid, text. though. Sally get Sally yeah. deserves it. Yeah. He actually tried to not accept it. I said, you, if well, you don't accept well, it, we, we went. In I'm gonna fucking we are, use a thousand dollars and burn something down. Guys on Staten Island, we're we're uh, yeah, we're man of our word. He wanted to make sure it wasn't final. No, I, I I'm oh. I'm almost positive that I said well, you football said playoff, college football finals. I think I said that, it because so. I wanted to hedge out. So all bets are paid. Sally was right. Good for him. Thousand bucks for him. Um, okay, who's your pick in this game? Uh, you know, I wrote down Texas, and I think I'm just ah uh, man. I agree with everything you're saying with Washington, but I think I'm just gonna stick with Texas. Washington over. I don't know if I said over, but I want over. Well. Over. Yeah, I'm I'm with you on Texas. Region. I don't love it though. I don't either. I don't. I don't no, either. But I'm gonna write I down Texas. I love Washington. I'm also in a spot where I have to bet against Washington because yeah, I, can't I think that, that that makes the blow a little. It softens the blow Correct. for you. So I will be rooting for Texas. Um, I just think Texas. The one thing that scares me is Texas secondary is not great, right. but everything else they do is pretty damn phenomenal. So, um, but you're right, Dave. Washington, like their defense has been so much better. So much. So much better. Okay, quick break. Tell you about our friends at BetterHelp. Pick'em is sponsored by BetterHelp. Whether or not your family gives gifts during the holidays, you get to define how much you give to yourself. And the holidays are a great time to do that. So whether it's by starting therapy, going easier on yourself during the tough moments, or treating yourself to a day of complete rest, remember to give yourself some love this holiday season. That is very important. If you're thinking of starting therapy, give BetterHelp a try. It's entirely online, designed to be convenient, flexible, and suited to your schedule. Just fill out a brief questionnaire and get matched with a licensed therapist and switch therapist anytime for no additional charge. In the season of giving, give yourself what you need with BetterHelp. Visit BetterHelp.com slash Pick'em today to get 10% off your first month. That's BetterHelp, H-E-L-P, dot com slash Pick'em, P-I-C-K-E-M. Uh, all right, last game, and then we will do, so everyone's got to have two mortal locks, regular bowls, and then one from these two. Alabama, Michigan, Michigan's minus one. Over-under is 45 and a half. Dave? I've said how I feel about this, and it's not just, uh, like, hyperbole. I, I just don't – I'm not sold on Alabama. I, I The quarterback, I don't like. I don't think he can throw. Uh, I think Michigan coming off losing last year in the way they did to TCU, all the controversy, they've risen to the occasion. Uh, I like Michigan to win this football game, and I also love the line. Like, all you hear is Bama, 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 Bama. Michigan's favored. Michigan is favored in this game. The line hasn't really moved at all. Um, 
I think the sharp money is on Michigan. The fools are in Alabama, and they're thinking is one of the all-time Alabama teams. It's not. Yeah, they beat Georgia. That changes the nature of their season. Auburn is horrible. They had no business being Auburn. That's not like, oh, yeah, they squeaked by them. They need a miracle that Auburn was stupid and they lose that game. That This, I love Michigan. Love. Do you worry a little bit about this overlooming narrative of, like, sometimes, you know, the scripts we say in football? Bama Texas rematch because I agree with you. Michigan's a different team, and now third time in the playoff. This is when you break through and get to a championship. That is a fair point, though. The storybook, like, the storybook is vibe that it. it's Bama Texas, and yeah. I'm not knocking on no, Michigan. But, it's but just how it goes. I you can I can just argue that the the storybook is Michigan with all the controversy. Also true. Also America's true. team. A very good point. This game has me twisted because I think I do think that Michigan has the best defense that Alabama will face. But I also am a little scared because there has not been a dynamic offense that Michigan has faced. Like Jalen Milrow, his ability know. to throw and pass. I don't think I mean, a throw. run. He can throw the deep ball. He can throw the deep I, ball. I watch Alabama, and when you play a defense like Michigan, you can't, you can't get do-overs. And he is he misses lots of guys. If you miss one guy in a series versus Michigan, the odds are you're punting. So I, I just don't think he's consistent enough. I don't think Michigan's gonna give up the big play. I love Michigan. Okay. Yeah, I wrote down Michigan as well, but I, I do worry about and to Dave's point, the line being when is Saban a fucking dog? Never. I mean, literally like, last week. Yeah, okay. Other than that That was pretty quick. Was yes, it, it was. You're right, Dan. You're right. Was... Dan, you're right. Okay. Overall though, he's been I think, <laughs> That was tough. Four. And that was tough. That was literally oh, the last no, no, game no, they played. No, 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 because I know that point. It's okay. four times in the last like five or, or I'm sorry, four in the last like ten years or eight years. I feel like I don't think that's true. literally the entire country is saying. Alabama when else would they have been a dog? Be Championship them. game. They've been cha- they've been dogs to Georgia a couple times. They were definitely dogs to LSU uh, when they had Burrow, right? Oh, that was that was oh, because that was at Alabama, right? Alabama. Well, so when else have they been dogs? Mincy, national championship game. I'll text Brad. My only issue with betting all this money on Michigan, the more I'm thinking, I like Washington equally. That's my only issue. So what are you gonna do? I don't know. It's like Michigan's almost like a heart. Like I wouldn't be. I'm betting that I'm gonna be there, and I said it. But I would put a million on what about Washington. what about million dollar parlay? <laughs> well, don't do a million dollar parlay. But obviously the games are at different times. Uh, where first? No, you're second. Oh, you are first. No, we're first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the Rose Bowl. I'm stupid. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're right. So you yeah, do. so you can't do that. No, but you I could do it, and then if I win, put. Uh, yeah, you just roll over onto Washington. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what you got to do. But th- I'm not two million on Washington. If I won, yeah, not two million on Michigan in the championship. Well, no, well, if he wins. I, if Michigan's his championship, he'll have a bankroll to do whatever. Yeah, he wants. right. I, yeah. I'm saying I like Washington. Putting it all on Washington, right after. Oh no, don't do that. No, that's what I was saying. Oh, yeah. so much. okay, that got it. Be, don't do that. That's what I did. That would take. That would be your biggest bet take, ever, right? But that's also, that would take a million. Would be my biggest. Worst. I've never bet a million. Don't do that. I'm saying so. Doing two don't do that because you 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 would have the highest of highs beating Alabama, winning a million dollars, and then if you yeah, that's. That's an old school Dave gambling right there. Where that's it's what like, I did. I, I, I went one and one today, and I lost. Really Villanova hammered it, and then blood, took Duke. Like, <laughs> all, like I have that feeling, <laughs> like it's you. It's a drug. Like yeah. I that feeling of just thinking about oh two million in Washington. Woo! You're gonna you're gonna text me like I went one and one. I won a million dollar bet today, and I have nothing to show for it. I lost. A million. <laughs> lost. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. One and one lost a million after the biggest bet ever. Uh, okay, I'm I'm gonna take. What do you need, PFT? I don't see it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Nice kicks. What's up? What's going on? Uh. All right. Of course. Um. PFT. Everybody. Hey. Hey. <laughs> uh, all right. I'm going to take Michigan. If you got to make a lock in the semis, I'll, I'll make it Michigan. I, I, to, I worry I hate, about I don't want to take Bury, but I, I don't love Texas either. So I'm 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 not I'm never really a big semifinal guy like in the sense of feeling the sides. So that's always been the case. I'm going to take the over in this game. I I lean Alabama, but I don't 
if the, if you're going with a million dollar bet, there's no way I'm betting out. Yeah, Alabama. you got any targets of these ba- uh, Bama guys in the office? What? Travi, uh, Mancini, Jake Bass. Those that are so below. Are you? T- you're not taking Roll Tide Willie. Is he going? No. Oh, okay. I don't know if he's going. <laughs> yeah. I can ask. Well, I no. He, they won't do that. They're actually pretty cool. Yeah. No, Willie's the best. Yeah. Um, he made that video with Drew Skeet. It was yeah. awesome. Yeah. Uh, all right. So locks in this in these games. Hank. Michigan. Okay. Rico. Michigan. Zoopy. Uh, I'm going Washington. Okay. Bama. Bama. Ooh, Jack Mac. Okay. I have no problem with that. Listen, I, there's so much going on in this game. I hate it. I mean, Austin. No pick. Zoopy. You said Washington. 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 All right. I got the stat. Uh, well, how many times? Since 2010. They're three and one straight up and oh, three so and one right. against the spread as an underdog. All four games versus Georgia. This is the first time they've been an underdog to any team not named Georgia since the 2009 SEC championship game. Shout out Brad Powers. The okay, best. there you go, Brad. Yeah, that's huge. Never. A, I was crazy saying eight. They're never a fucking dog, dude. That's crazy. Never. That is crazy. And um, they, when they are, they win. Michigan's your lock, Dave. I'll take the over in Alabama. Michigan is my lock. Can we, uh, yeah, I have. Can I? I yeah. I also want to can do too. I also want to lock Washington. Yeah, I guess I could be your second. It could take it. Yeah, because you we're, we're going to do All right. the second oh. be from anywhere. Yeah. Okay. All right. So any other picks, and then we'll do our last mortal locks yeah. from just bowl season. So all right, uh, I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play play these now, and then I I will get involved in a lot more. Uh, but UCF minus four and a half against Georgia Tech, <laughs> Air Force plus three against JMU. Uh, that's the Armed Forces Bowl. I, like I have that. that as well. I like that, JMU. J- but, Air- there, there's a bunch of – I think their whole defense is transferring. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, Air Force is – they're legit. They'll be fine. Kansas, UNLV, over 64.5. Oak State, plus three against A&M. A&M, joke of a fucking program. This one was going to be my lock, but I'm worried about this BC quarterback. I love SMU, minus 10.5. Um, that one will be the lock. Clemson, minus 4.5, I got a real good feeling about. Clemson's ranked. Dabo is like – rallying the true you know like it beats an sec team it's a nice little capstone to a season when everyone said they were a disaster clemson minus four and a half tennessee minus eight and a half um and we just got the word if you're familiar with the show the pinstripe bowl my uncle is 0 12 straight up with the team he gets assigned Uh-oh. he has been assigned miami yes that was actually my that's my lock Rutgers? Rutgers. yeah yeah he's been assigned I, that, that's 12 a classic Guys coming from South Florida up to – they don't want to play in the pinstripe bowl. Rutgers will travel. Oh, my God. Rutgers – Soprano like, people there. TJ was uh, – TJ, they were they were 6-2 uh, and two when he was celebrating being bowl eligible. I was like, dude, you're 6-2. and two. What about the rest of the season? He's like, well, we got to a bowl. Yeah, That's how Rutgers is. You want yeah. the lock? Yeah, get, well, no, we'll wait for your lock. What's your card? I've been riding these guys, and they've just been cash, North cash, Western. cash, Western. cash. Northwestern North plus seven against Utah – Cash, cash. Uh, Kansas UNLV over 64 and a half. Kansas State minus three. NC State. Arizona minus three. The quarterback's gone, right, at Oklahoma? Dan, Dan yes. Gabriel. Going to yeah, Oregon. Yeah, he's going to Oregon. Yeah. Yeah. Which is, he's going to be good there. Yeah, he will be. He was good at Oklahoma. Yeah. 62 and a half over. I feel like they'll have someone else who can play. I agree with Rico on Clemson. What's that? Minus four and a four half. Four and a half. what I wrote down. They all can move. Whatever Jack locks them in at. Missouri minus two and a half. Ohio State over. 48 and a half. Old Miss plus three and a half against Penn State. Uh, FSU plus 14. Uh, Wyoming minus three over 44 and a half. Tennessee minus eight and a half against Iowa. Michigan minus one, Washington plus six, plus four, and the over 63 and a half. My two mortals, if I could do three, it would be Northwestern. But if I can only do two, I will do uh, Washington and Michigan. Okay. I have uh, – You know what? I'm going to do Washington Northwestern, and Michigan will be my million-dollar bet. Yeah, that's actually good because then you want to you want to win Bob Diaco too. Um, and you, that's, you're putting everything into one game Correct. if you do that. All right, I have Oklahoma State plus three as well. I have uh, Rutgers, I did say my lock. Rutgers plus one. Air Force plus three. Iowa plus eight and a half. I'm different right. than you. Iowa just wins ugly bowl games. Like, they, they're they just going to muck that shit Yeah, up. the total is 36. So, like, if you look at that, you probably should take. Yeah. yeah. And also, uh, Wyoming minus three we already talked about. It, the big I'll thing for me with bowl games is, like, I always just try to look for good running teams because these guys have taken a month off and the passing game always looks clunky to start. If you can run the football, just they show up and they run the football. And guys don't want to, you know, 
I don't want to get fucking smoked in, in at the line of scrimmage for a game that means nothing. All right, other locks. Hank. Ole Miss. Ole Miss plus three and a half. Rico. Uh, Arizona minus the three. I like Oklahoma that. Oklahoma without a quarterback. You liked Oklahoma or you liked the over? I had Arizona in the over. I had I like Arizona, Arizona in my card. I think Arizona had a great year. It's a story. Yeah. Like, like, who cares about bowl games? Rarity. Arizona yep. cares about a bowl game. I will always back that strategy now when no one cares about bowl game. Yep. And I don't think Oklahoma gives a fuck. Yep. Uh, Zoopy. Mine's also Arizona. Okay. Jack. Uh, I'm going to take Liberty plus 17 and a half against Oregon. Okay. Austin, no pick. Uh, Ebo? Uh, uh, my semifinal is going to be the under in Texas, Washington, uh, and then I'm going to take the uh, Oregon minus 17. Okay. Dave, you already did yours. Yep. I did mine. Good show. Great show. Oh, Liam. Liam, give us both yours. All right, Rutgers and over in Michigan as well. So Liam's got those two. Um, great show. Great show. Great season. Great show. So are we done? Are we yeah, I mean we yeah. we'll do we'll do as usual. We'll do a, a March Madness pick them. Yeah, we'll oh, do a March Madness. Pick them. Back. Is that part of the negotiation? I mean, do you want it? Do you want to do one before the the championship game? We can. No, we don't need it. Okay. Are you guys doing a show at the championship game? No, I don't think so. No, I don't think okay. so. Uh, so, I don't even know. I, I, I don't know whether I'll, if, if Michigan wins, I haven't decided whether I'll go or live stream. I, I'm not a huge fan of the Houston. Yeah. Of Houston, but, yeah, it was not a great season. But it is going to be a great game regardless. Regardless. So, well, also, the, the, the championship that, game. Are still on the do not enter list? Is that, no, I didn't. That was Atlanta. I was Atlanta. Yeah. Uh, he went to the Final Four in Houston. Um, and it's not an NFL. Uh, 1-8 for the championship game will be the inaugural Ryder Con. Apparelli's. Apparelli's. So for got the all sorts of yeah, Ryder Con, Ice Con, all these cons going on. I like this. We're gonna watch the game in between. Probably maybe have a DJ. You do some name that tune. Yes, one on one burpees. Trivia. Saved by the Bell against Frank with the Mets. If Four I don't bucks. get, I'll say one thing about Ryder Con. This I'm very excited for you, Rico. If I don't get a video of like 25 riders with their shirts off doing burpees in the Barelli parking lot. I'll be very upset. I guess it's as good a time to to pr help promote my friend uh, Elio is doing IceCon as well, which uh, he didn't really – he wasn't even calling it that, but we were in the car the other day. Where were we? Oh, Celtics. He's like, how far is it from Miami to where the Panthers, Florida Panthers play hockey? I'm like, I don't know, hour, 45 minutes. Why? He's like, eh, like just me and some of the ice people are doing like a meetup. I'm like, how many? He's like 50 to 100 of us, I think, in March. We're just going to like wear white shirts and stuff. So <laughs> – IceCon is coming in March for anybody who wants to be part of that. Love it. Yeah. Morelli's 1 8. Everyone just ripping stuff with their shirts off. <laughs> Imagine 100 it's, ice people ripping shirts off. Yeah, it's going to be like the Eminem music video where it's just a <laughs> yes, bunch of Eminems. Yes. Right. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be great. Uh, all right. Thank all you, right. everyone. Happy uh, Hanukkah, yeah, we'll Merry do Christmas. We'll do a March Madness, so you'll hear from us then. Uh, Go blue. Great job. Congratulations, Rico. Thanks.